Hello everybody, I'm a cynical butthole and welcome back to Dead Space. So, we're moving right along here. I don't remember what the last thing we did was. Um, we got to this area, I suppose. Um, no, no, actually we released the asteroid from our control. Communications log. First comms operator Bailey reporting. The ship is under attack, but requests to issue a distress call have been repeatedly denied by Captain Matthias. He won't say it, but everyone on the bridge knows why. This is an illegal operation in a prohibited system. We've all known for months, and we kept our mouths shut. Not anymore. Mayday, 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 this is USG Ishimura. This is... What the hell? I don't believe this. The whole comm system is offline. Now he's gone too far. Bailey out. Okay, so... As I was saying, we released the asteroid into space with a beacon on it to put out a distress signal. Uh, in that amount of time, we have received a call back, I believe. But, we're unable to answer it currently. This looks bad. We're unable to answer it currently because our comm system are, again, offline. So, I'm heading to the bridge, I believe, to reactivate the comm system. Whoa. Okay. Gee, this is a pretty cool sequence. Communications Bye. array offline. A service technician has been notified. Service. That comms array is in bad shape. We need at least six working dishes for a strong enough signal. Make sure they're aligned symmetrically so there are no power gaps. Okay, well, before we do anything, let's get our save on. Time to align some dishes. Oh. Assassin? I hear some voices. Entering and zero gravity. I see you there. Separate the arm. Wasting so much ammo here. I'm gonna wait for one of them to make a leap before I do anything. There we go. I'm gonna reload. Oh shit! You gotta be kidding me! Well, the good news is... Oh, I have to get that in there. Okay, well, let's just throw it over there then. Just see if that works. No, not surprising. <laughs> Probably shouldn't have done that. Get that right there. And, oh, whatever's in here. Great, cool. Okay, communication control. So there's one, two, three, four, five, six total. Uh, six active total. There's one, two, three, four, five, six of those total. So what I should probably do is cluster them around the center, like these uh, two are. So we're gonna pop this one out. Communications array realigned. Messages can now be received. That's it. It's working. Get back to communications and use the control panel to send our coordinates to the Valor. Ooh, that was cool. Okay. I hear voices again. That was a pretty interesting little sequence. I like that. Exiting zero gravity. This is USM Valor, widecasting on all frequencies to USG Ishimura in response to your SOS. We picked up your escape pod number four oh, and no. are route to your position. This message will repeat every 30 seconds until you respond. An escape pod that has gooey what? monsters on it. Isn't that the escape pod Hammond jettisoned? One of those things was on board. No. No, this isn't going to happen. USM Valor. Come in, Valor. Our signal isn't strong enough. I'm going to open the blast doors to boost the signal. Error. Blast door blockage detected. Please contact the repair technician. Shit! Isaac, there's something big on the hull of the ship, directly above the comms array. Something organic. I don't know what it is, and I don't care. We have to get the doors open to transmit to the Valor. 
You should have a clear shot from ADS Cannon 48. Get to the cannon and blow it out into space. Okay. Oh, that's my favorite thing, you know, large organic life forms. Oh, it's big guns time again. Manual override initiated. Shit. Did I die? Is that it? I wish I could just talk to someone. It's all falling apart here. I <laughs> Isaac. <laughs> Isaac, are you there? Thank God you're all right. I've been trying to reach you. Someone's been blocking my rig signal remotely. <coughs> A crash must have interrupted the signal block. Hammond, where have you been? <laughs> Surviving. Barely. I found some med supplies and packed myself up. Listen. I'm calling aboard on the mission. Fuck the CEC and fuck the chain of command. We have to get the hell out of here. I think I've located a shuttle on the crew deck. The flight log says it needs a new singularity core, but we can probably salvage one from the Valor. I can see the tail end of it sticking out from the side of the Ishimura. I'm headed down there now to find a way inside. I'll meet you there. Come and out. Isaac, if what he says is true about the shuttle, we might have a chance of getting out of here. Head to the cargo bay and see if you can help Hammond. In his condition, he may not last long. Okay. Well, that was pretty fucking crazy. I was shooting at it. I didn't think it would stop it, but, you know. <laughs> Me. Anyway. Jesus Christ, that was bonkers. Alright, so... I, all right, we'll continue this episode for now. I'm curious to see what happens. I've only been recording for about 19 minutes, so I want to get some more footage before we uh, call it an episode. And I might even do a super long episode. All right, well, back we go, I guess. That sounded pleasant. Oh, hey, buddy. the rest of your pals. I remember killing you guys last time. 
But... Door's already open. That worries me. Okay. We'll save station. Might as well. Alright, cool. Another chapter down, I guess. Chapter 8. Search and Rescue. Total fucking failure. Nice. Great. Alright, so we'll run through a little bit more of the next bit. Because I am still curious as to what's going to happen next. And I want to meet with Hammond again. It's been a long time since Jesus. Good, you made it inside. Listen, I just found the munitions log for the Valor. I don't think their presence here is a coincidence. They're not on reconnaissance and they're not on patrol. This ship is prepped for war. They're on a secret destroy mission. Do you hear me? Yes. Isaac, I've lost him again. No signal from Hammond's rig. Find the Singularity core and get the hell out of there. Okay. Find the gravity. Okay. Let's do this. I am the ready. Oh, this looks... Entering zero gravity. Fun. Isaac. One of the Valor's weapons ripped open in the crash. Those green orbs you see are highly radioactive, and the Valor's airlock has sealed itself. You're going to have to throw those into space before you can get into the ship. Beep. Beep. Entering Beep. vacuum. Radioactive material removed. Okay. That's weird. Radioactive material removed. Ah! <laughs> I knew you were coming. I couldn't hear you, but I knew it was going to happen. Oh boy. Okay. Yep, yeah, open up your little titties for me to shoot. <laughs> nice. I reload on. I don't know if there's any behind me, but we'll just shoot that Radioactive out. Radioactive material removed. That one. Come on. Nope, nope, nope. Not like that. Not, not, not. There we go. Boop. Radioactive material removed. Is that all of them? Looks like it. So let's do an oxygen recharge. Boop. Radiation hazard clear. Safety lock released. Yeah. So we going GTF. Oh. Come on. Come in. There we go. Whoa. Hey, buddy. What the fuck was that? The part right. you're looking for will be in the engine room at the back of the ship. I'm reading massive damage, so you may need to find an alternate route to get there. Yeah, no shit. Ooh. Uh huh. Think I don't know better? Everybody gets their legs popped off. process is doing something strange to these soldiers. They all have built-in stasis units in their body armor. The infection is merging the stasis unit into their flesh or something, making them move fast. Real fast. Be careful. Roger that. Okay. I see you back there, too. Oh boy! No, no, no! Quick reload before it gets all. There we go. Thought I heard another one. Nice. All right, so it looks like we're fighting a new enemy now. Like it said, it looks like they've had their stasis modules formed and changing their biology. I guess. A good way to describe it. And as such. Okay, and as you just saw, they're real fucking fast. So I'm gonna have to be careful with guys like that, because they are extremely fast. Isaac. 
real fucking weird. Definitely not something I'm fond of. Ugh. Ah. Funky. Ramo, please. Isaac, I'm tracking your position, but it doesn't look like I can reach you. This damn ship was nearly shared in half. I made it to the bridge. It's a mess here. These poor bastards didn't stand a chance. I'm going to override all door locks so you can get to the engine room. I'll try and catch up with you there. Okay. So I noticed there was a power node back there behind me. There's a power node right there in front of me. Alright, we're gonna say right here. Um... You know, I'm gonna call the episode right here. Um... I'll see if I can record another one to keep the story going, but uh, I'm already pushing the time limit here. So thank you so much for watching. Uh, I really appreciate any time you take out of your day, you know, hanging out and checking my videos. But um, thank you for watching, and I'll catch you next time.